Hey guys, it's with Jack, the legend here today. I'm here with the Alpha Craft episode. And right now, I'm standing at Fox's shop because I was just checking it out. But while we're here, we're gonna go have a look at what we've been doing at Spawn. So let's go. We started by building a light grey concrete platform. Now we had to terraform around it and it had to be quite big because of the size of the build. We decided to use light grey concrete because it gave a real contrast to the stone of the building and it also gives the poured concrete feel of a platform in real life. So there we have it, a light grey concrete platform. Now that's a lot of concrete. While I was doing this, Wild was working on some stairs. There she is now. Hey Wild. Hey guys, welcome to my work on the grand staircase. This grand staircase is central and will lead up to the second and third floors. It's made of quartz and stone brick and I'm planning on using some cobblestone walls but I have a bit of a problem, Jax. I've run out of quartz completely! Uh oh, that means it's time for the nether and gasps and all the evil stuff. We have a plan for this nether trip. We're gonna take Handy Smurf to keep us safe. Fingers crossed you don't poke any creatures. Poke poke! So let's go! Last time we were here, Jax managed to fall in a one by one hole of lava. Yes, I did, and that was a sad moment in, time, in the time. Oh, that is not a good place to mine. Stop, don't mine under you. No, that would be silly. Yeah. Yeah. Here, what a... come get your fire resistance potions. Ooh. Dirt, boom. Ooh. Ooh, wow, a lot. I'll take two. I'll grab more later. Yeah. Yeah. You were prepared, Handy. Is there more I void this way? Ooh, you are. Eight away. I'll help you get those eight. Where are you, Handy? I've got my no, sword out. No. <laughs> There's a pig man I can poke. Oh, I just placed. <gasps> wait, beds don't explode in the end anymore? Oh, wait, they do. Yes, yes, they do. <laughs> Really? <laughs> okay then. I'm glad I wasn't there. <laughs> this is what happened. Oh my god. Do you need potions again? No, I, 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 I we kept those. Do you need food? Yes, I think she needs food. There. Okay, now let's head along and find some more quartz, cause. I was yeah, before Jax gets too close. <laughs> Jax, stay away yes. from the lava. Is there lava? Hold on, let me drink my potion of fire resistance. I don't think I might get I too tempted. Whoa. Ooh, ghast. There's a ghast. Jax. <laughs> what? <gasps> I almost... Not about to be. I almost hit a pig man. I just shot the ghast's fireball, and that's what killed the fireball. No way. I am like, I should be a part of FaZe Clan with those types of- <gasps> I almost fell down that hole. Oh, I went down. Oh, why? You went the wrong way, Jack. But there's a whole Goodbye. bunch of- down there today. You were evil. <laughs> evil, I'm telling you. Evil. Evil can evil. Hey, when you told me I needed a bunch of stuff to, to come mine with you, I knew I didn't want to be next to you. We're coming. How much right. quartz does everyone have? I have one, two, three, four, five, six stacks. Six stacks. Wow. Six, six stacks and one quartz. Alright. But again, now we look. Before you guys die. Yeah. Give me your quartz. Okay. <laughs> That's probably a good idea. Wait, put it in here. Yeah. Ah, good idea. Fantastic. Bigger. Oh, Abba was on it. Avaromance, what's on? Is Avaro's favorite fruit Does avocado? Like avocado? Avaro, do you like avocados? <laughs> if you're watching this, comment on down toast? below if you like avocados on toast or in a sandwich. In your salad? That's a thing. I think that it might be an Australian thing. I think avocados also go on burgers sometimes. What? Yes. No, never. Yeah, I'm uh, almost certain. Oh, yeah, tacos. Okay. Wait, hold on, because I have fire resistance on. Can I walk into this lava? Yes, I can. Yes. 
<laughs> okay, I'm happy. Is she not? Way, oh, oh no! Ah, ah. Oh, I thought that was gonna hit me. I killed it! Oh, oh, that was so good! That was so good! I shot the fireball, I shot the fireball, and it went back and killed the ghast. So wild. I've got something to tell you. I really want to make another diamond hoe, can I? You have three. Well, he lost them all. No, 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 I have all of them, but still I want to make more. Please. What is the point? You don't even use them. No, I do use them. They are the most useless things in Minecraft. Did you know if you um use a full diamond heart, you get this um achievement and basically stating start to rethink your life choices while when making a, this diamond heart. Really? Or something like that, yeah. <laughs> no way. And I just I think that is so awesome. You know what, I'm just gonna let so you... So I'm gonna to cut to the end well, once we've found enough quartz now, because... Yeah, so I'll see you guys when we've got all of our quartz. Ow, don't punch me. Bye. Okay, we're gonna jump off the edge, but I'm gonna do the honors. <laughs> and let's go. <laughs> Thanks to Handy and his potions and ender chest, we are back from the nether in one piece. And I didn't die once. Incredible. Alrighty, we've got a lot of quartz. But we still need a lot of stone. So, let's head to the stone generator, which Phil most wonderfully built us with our silk touch pickaxe and get some stone. Right, we've got the stone. So now it's time to continue building. First things first, we need to get this back wall to the height it's going to be at. I shall do that. It is quite satisfying watching you do this. Once we had finished the stone, we started decorating it. This is a main archway to the platforms. We've used quartz, stone, and stone brick stairs and slabs to decorate it. We also used some cobblestone walls and diorite blocks for some extra pizzazz. Oh, we also finished the stairs on the other side. While we go through the arch, you can see another area that we've tiled before you go onto the platform. Coming out onto the platform, we added some outbuildings, including a waiting room and a toilet. Although we made this waiting room very simple, we still added some stairs and glass to decorate it. And I also added some bench seats inside the waiting room. We've still got to finish the toilets and add a little bit more decoration, but it's coming along nicely. Come along outside and we'll show you what we've done. Outside, we finished the paving and added some cute birch trees. And then I came along again with more bench seats. It's really starting to come together. While I was planning out the next floor of the build, Jax went ahead and added in the walls. The walls are made out of a combination of stone brick and stone and will for now only go up to the height of the current outside walls. Eventually these walls will be built up higher to the height of the back wall. We're actually going to be adding in a mezzanine floor so we have to do that before we do anything else. Wow, the spawn build is looking pretty good so far. And pretty big. You can say that again. And pretty big. Thank you, Wild. While we were building, we noticed there was something missing from Wooded Hollows. I feel a speed build coming on.
So there we have it, the Wooded Hollow General Store and Tourist Center. It was a smallish build, but it was an incredibly fast one. Let's have a look inside. The General Store definitely sells everything you need, but it's looking a bit abandoned right now. Oh, and the Tourist Center has pumpkin tours. Definitely not going on one of those again. Uh oh, they sell growth hormone. I hope no one buys any. Upstairs is pretty cute, if not frugal, and pretty abandoned again. In this Alphacraft episode, we've done quite a lot of work at Spawn and a little bit of work at Wooded Hollows. But while I was finishing up the decoration, I noticed a strange chest. So, let's go and have a look. I noticed it right beneath these stairs here. There's a book in quill in here, okay. I am writing this in case anyone should find it and be able to get help. At first we thought the spill at the Institute was an accident, but now we are sure it is something far more sinister. The growth factor that a professor discovered is not what we thought. It was. The town is in ruins and everyone has fled. I am the only one left and I have moved the town's precious artworks to the rail tunnel. There are rumours of strange events to the south and I am going to see if I can stop this madness spreading, but I fear I may be, I will be too late. If I make it back, I will detail in this book what I find. Lord Hollows. That could lead. Something evil, I might have to go check out my wild one and see if she knows anything. But for now, it's going to be the end of the video guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please leave a like, comment, and remember to subscribe if you're new, and watch out for any strange or weird update, because this book is really creepy. I'm not sure if it's a good or bad thing. So I'll see you guys later. Peace. And remember, stay carbonated.